All right, folks, we got a lot of new and exciting things happening for 2021, right? Um, I haven't really posted it on this page, but I know a lot of you on this page follow my other channel. But we talked about the new DeWalt mowers that are going to, that are going to be coming out um, in 2021, right? Um, found out they're going to be made by MTD slash Cub Cadet, right? Now, if you're not familiar... Stanley Black and Decker owns DeWalt. They own a lot of <laughs> different brands. But a couple of years ago, they started investing in MTD. So I believe now they are 20, 25% owner. Okay, a majority owner um, of MTD now. Now, obviously, well, 20% isn't a majority owner. I think there's like four or diff four or five different companies that own a piece of MTD now. Um, it used to be a private, well, it still is a, a private company, but was more of a, a family-owned company up until, you know, 10, 15, 20 years ago. And obviously the Cub Cadet introduction really turned MTD around into a, a very large company. So I think in order to acquire the Cub Cadet brand, I guess you had to bring in different owners and stuff and different investors, but whatever. All right, so there's going to be a couple different models of the DeWalt Stander and Zero Turn. Basically, just some engine differences and some deck size differences, um, but also... My man Nate just sent this to me. They really, now this is a total redesign, all right? So if you've been following me, I, I covered the, the Raptor, you know, and again, if you're not familiar, the Raptor, the Hustler Raptor was really the first mower, in my opinion, to kind of hit that prosumer market, right? It was under 3,000, really the first mower you we're only going to spend around 3000 and get a fabricated deck. Um, even though you only had 2,200 hydros, again, um, you know, it had more of a prosumer build to it. And really with that mower and that mower alone, and obviously it was the first to kind of hit the big box stores as well. And if you remember, Home Depot and Lowe's carried the Raptor. Um, I believe Home Depot carried it for maybe one or two years, and then Lowe's carried it five, six years. Um, looks like that relationship is over. So hustlers are not are no longer carried in any big box store, just to let you guys know. But they kind of updated this mower last year, right? We saw the foot-operated deck lift that they added to the Raptor. But this is a total redesign, all right? Now, if they can keep, I mean, <laughs> I'm going to see if I can find prices on this, but it does look very similar. Now, again, they're calling it a total redesign. Um, you know, it looks like you got a little black face plate now. It looks like maybe the plastic fenders are a little bit different. The deck looks exactly the same. Um, looks like obviously you got, you know, some different back tires i guess uh i think they call them the big bite tires that were on the xds um no more sd right and sdx that we've known unless well there's the xdx but they're calling it the xd and there's also an xl so the sd is now the xd and the sdx is now the xdx um, the seat is really the same. As you know, they updated the seat last year. It looks like only thing they did now was put some armrests on it. Let's see what this video has to say here. The all new Raptor series packs all the performance, reliability, and heavy duty strength you expect in a hustler with some new performance upgrades. Let's have a closer look, starting with the premium residential frame. 
The all-new Raptor X has a continuous one-piece, 11-gauge welded tubular frame, elevating strength and durability in the residential zero-turn category. The premium V-twin Kawasaki engine comes in an 18 and a 21.5 horsepower option. The combination of the engine the Hydrogear ZT2200 transmissions and the 18-inch Big Bite tires give the Raptor a top speed of 7 miles per hour. You will not find the Big Bite tire from any other manufacturer. The heavy-duty fabricated welded steel decks provide a commercial-grade cut quality and add durability, extending the life of the mower. The all-new seat comes standard with armrests, increased lumbar support, and an airflow channel in the back for exceptional comfort. The Raptor X features Hustler's exclusive Smooth Track trademark so again, one mile providing hour. precision control to help to trim and maneuver an easily hour, around obstacles. Seven. The standard rubber floor mat provides premium comfort by reducing vibration to the operator's feet. Additional platform width in combination with wider front tires provides added comfort and a smoother ride for the operator. Some wider front tires too. Easily adjust the deck height between one and a half and four and a half inches with your foot. Easier than hand-operated lifts found on other brands. Easily service and maintain your Raptor X with a flip-up seat pan, removable floor pan, that's and that's vented good. pulley covers. Compared to the Raptor X, the all-new Raptor XL has an upgraded seat with a higher back and additional padding. Standard flex forks for a smoother ride. The XL has a 23-horsepower V-twin Kawasaki option. The all-new Raptor XD comes with an upgraded seat, adding additional comfort with a higher backrest and more bolstered seat and back cushion. A larger 60-inch deck option is available on the XD. Added center anti-scalp wheel and 3 8 by 1 inch full coverage impact bar adds strength and rigidity. Along with a trim side replaceable bumper, these features help to extend the life of your deck. Larger 13 inch front caster tires provide a smoother ride for the operator. The Raptor XD comes with larger Hydro Gear ZT2800 transmissions, larger 20 inch big bite tires, and a 24 horsepower V-twin Kawasaki option. The combination of the engine, transmissions, and the 20 inch big bite tires gives the Raptor XD a top speed of seven and a half miles per hour. The all new Raptor XDX is the ultimate ride with a higher backrest and more bolstered seat and back I cushion four different compared seats to the Raptor XD. Things. The XDX offers a commercial grade 10 gauge fabricated welded steel deck with a bull nose front bumper guard for added durability and rigidity and a replaceable trim guard. Cast steel deck hanger brackets also add strength and durability to the mower. The Raptor XDX comes with larger Hydro Gear ZT3100 transmissions. With even larger 22 inch big bite tires and upgraded transmissions, the XDX can mow at up to eight miles per hour. The Raptor series from Hustler Turf just raised the bar for residential zero-turn lawnmowers. There is now a premium residential category. October um, show. Let me get out of this. Um, did what the heck? Oh my god! The grounds was it GI GI GID? I don't remember. But <clears throat> excuse me. Um, it's uh, you know, well, it's really going to come down to price, guys, with this. But again, you're seeing a lot. This. You know, again, Hustler started this segment kind of and, you know, for a good two or three year reign, especially being in the big box stores, they were definitely kicking butt. There's been a lot of cutbacks backs over at Hustler. Um, I actually heard from a couple people. They were not doing really well. There's been a lot of layoffs. Uh, I believe they're um, headquartered in Kansas. Um, so. They needed to kind of, they were losing market share pretty quickly in this segment. And again, this, remember, Hustler used to be one of the top dogs in, you know, the real, you know, the X, what was it called? The the Hustler X1 used to be one of the most popular mowers um, for commercial guys to be using, right? 
and the fast track was very popular. I mean, the fast track, these mowers have kind of, that's the one thing. You, you kind of, with introducing mowers like this, you're kind of killing your mid prosumer segment with, with some of these mowers now, right? Like, why buy the fast track that's, you know, 65 hundred to seven thousand dollars when you can buy this xdx they both have 3100 hydros um you know maybe there's a little bit difference in the size of the gas tank but that's the big thing i hope they improve that um but having the uh the floor pan is great because now you can get at those belts a lot easier There might be a price here. New 2021 product. Oh, he's starting at $3,099. So now they're over $3,000. All right. And this is probably for your 42 inch starting at $3,099. Last year, you could have got the same mower for $2,799, except, you know, the big bite tires and really cosmetic stuff, guys. There's no real difference to these mowers. Um, except some cosmetic stuff. The deck again looks identical. Um, I would love to know. I mean, I'm going to spend $3,100 on a seat like this. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> All right, maybe we got yeah three, and it has the same three gallon gas um, tank. So, and if you remember, they came. I don't know if that they're still making that one mower. What was it? The, the Hustler Dash, right? I, I couldn't believe when they did that. That that just brought the Hustler name. I mean, uh, this is like uh, a latch, a, a last ditch effort, I think, for Hustler here. Um, that being said, it does go up to seven miles an hour. The regular hustler that we've known for the past five, six years. I think it was six and a half. But um, I don't know. Let's see how much that XL is. $3,500. bucks. I mean, again, does this even have, does this have the 2,800 hydros? I'll tell you, what I would do if you're interested, I'd go get last year's SDX model. Yeah, 42. Yeah, I mean, now I'm paying $3,500 for 2,200 hydros. These are going to be, this is going to be a big um, disaster. Unfortunately, I, I think for, for Hustler here, I mean, again, for the past five or six years, you could have got the Hustler SD and spent, you know, 35, 36, 3,800 and gotten 2,800 hydros and a much better seat. Uh, this seat looks like it's uh, pretty, pretty nasty here. So now to get 2,800 hydros for a Hustler product, you are getting flex forks, but those things are, I mean... No one cares about that. All right, XL, XD is our next level here. Yeah, you're going to have to spend $4,100 to enter that, you know, 2,800 hydro. And, um, again, when you got, um, you know, Gravely, you can get into theirs and, and Arian's. For thirty five hundred, thirty six hundred, I don't, I don't know. I, I don't. I don't see this being that that success, a successful line. And there's way too many mowers. You know, you got the XL, the XD, the S. I mean, come on. You come out with a Hustler and a Hustler SD. That's it. Then you go to your fast track. I mean, this. This. What was it? The X. DX, this should be your entry level fast track mower. All right, and then have a fast track SD. 
where, you know, maybe you put 3,400 hydros on. But whatever. Um, a lot of different lipstick, if you want my opinion. It, it, it's very similar. You're going to get the same deck. Um, the frame looks almost identical. A little different plastic moldings. Again, you do got the big bite tires and a new seat. But the old Hustler seat was really good, especially on the SDX. But it is something new. And since we do follow the Hustlers, I figured I'd make a video that I haven't really made in this channel in a while. But, guys, good luck. Peace.